It's a big game. I only got one more game. When people gonna be fired up, same focus, same concentration. If we do what we're supposed to do, then the game should be easy. You have to take care of business. We've been in this game before. Lights get on, the music start playing. I know my team's gonna step up. Welcome back. I'm Andrew Snicker. Welcome into Fox 31 Sports. Well, almost a year ago to the day, the Albany Panthers broke through for their first ever indoor football league championship, hoisting the trophy, the champagne showers. Those images still embedded deep into the minds of the Panthers players as they return for a taste of another title. And tonight it was their chance at a repeat. The Panthers ho hosting the title game for the second straight year. This time the Richmond Raiders are the opponent. Darnell Kennedy, the starting quarterback for Albany. And while well, he doesn't wait long, getting Albany on the board very quickly in the first drive. Minute and a half into this game, Kennedy hitting the corners for Antoinus cuts. That gives Albany a 7-0 lead. Now still in the first, Albany up 8-6 after an Uno. Kennedy going back to the air. Spread the ball around nicely. Touchdown pass to Clinton Rafe. Albany up 15-6. Looking like looking to run away with this one. Keep play here, though. Check it out here. Second quarter, same score. Richmond trying to score on fourth down and inches. Panthers defense coming up tough, coming up strong, stopping Antoine Young. And then two plays later, every time you get a defensive stop, you got to hit him where it hurts right here. And the Panthers on offense and Kennedy aiming at his third touchdown pass of the night. And this is going to be a connection to Antoine Savage. Bumped off the wall, but I'm sure he's feeling good after that one. Touchdown 22 to 6. Now a little bit later on off of Richmond score, Antoine is cuts with the kickoff and no one touches him here. He's going goal line to goal line, 50 yards for another Panthers score. Albany trying to score again late after they're up 29 to 13. But Kennedy's pass getting picked off right here at the goal line. Big one right here. Richmond returns for the touchdown at the half. The score is 36 to 30. Albany holding that slim lead. Now head coach Lucius Davis, let's hear your thoughts on the team's first half performance. We blew up two coverages that went for touchdowns. Uh, that, 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 that pick, you know, that hurt. Uh, we score on that drive. Uh, we are big right now. Um, so, you know, we, we just got to uh, keep plugging, man. It's going to be a tough game. We got 30 minutes to uh, close it out. Panthers coach Lucius Davis always seems cool, calm, and collected. And his team, also with quarterback Cecil Wester playing the second half, they played like champions in that half for the second straight year. The Albany Panthers are league champions. They win the PIFL this year. Albany defeats Richmond by the final score of 60-50.